game players around the world who are playing with too loose Q action. Um, and usually, if the Q action is too loose, what I mean is that you don't have your Q anchored on your bridge, on your grip, on your chest, on your chin, and then you can twitch or to Q slightly off straight very easily. So keep in mind that these four points are very important. You have to keep your Q under control by keeping on these four points. Not super tight, but tight enough so the Q cannot move. So when you're into your stance and you're preparing for your shot, you have to feel that your Q is on the chest, not just slightly brushing, but with enough pressure so the cue cannot move left or right, as well as your bridge, your chin, and your grip. If any of them points is too loose, then you allow the cue to go offline when you're striking the ball. Remember that it can be also too tight, and if you feel that your shots are restricted, then it is too tight and you have to loosen up a little bit. So here is the grip and this is example of too loose grip hand. So you can see that the cue can move everywhere in my hand. And that's not good because you can cue off straight very easy. This is a grip which is loose enough to make your cue moving forward and backward, but the cue now cannot go anywhere. When I'm trying to move the cue, you can see that the cue cannot move into my bridge hand, into my grip hand. And you have to keep your cue on the chest, not just slightly brushing, but tight enough on the chest to keep the cue on the line. If it's too loose, then the cue, of course, can move and then you miss the pot. So now this is just slightly brushing on the chest. I barely feel the cue on my chest. That's probably one out of 10 pressure. And now I'm really onto the cue with my chest and that's around five out of 10 pressure onto the chest. Same principle applies for the chin as well. You're looking for five out of 10 pressure on the chin tight enough that the cue cannot move off straight, but allows me to move the cue forward and backward. And the last point is the bridge hand. If your bridge is too loose, then your cue, of course, can go offline. So a too loose bridge is usually when the thumb is not tight enough and it's not solid. So if I place my cue on the bridge, and if I try to move the cue and if it moves, then this means that your bridge is not solid enough. If you make your bridge nice and tight, nice and firm, then if I try to move the cue, I cannot, and that will allow me to cue it better. So just remember to keep your cue under control, tight enough on these four points, the grip, chest, chin, and the bridge hand. Then your chance of cueing straight are better.